In this tutorial, we will look at how you can share your desktop screen during a Microsoft Teams meeting. So here I am in a meeting. I've got my video going, but now I want to share my screen to show something on my computer to my audience. So I'm going to click I'm going to move my mouse around so the toolbar pops up. And I'm going to click on this icon here with the up arrow. When you click that, you then have the option of choosing what you want to share. Now, in this case, I have several windows open. So it's giving me these options. Maybe I just want to share this PowerPoint that I have open. So you can select a specific application or window. In this case, I want to just go ahead and share my entire desktop that allow me to jump around and share different items while I'm in the meeting. Another option you have is this checkbox here, include system audio. By selecting this box, this will then allow your audience to hear sound that's being played back on your computer. Let's say you want to show a video on YouTube during your meeting. Well, if you don't select include system audio, they will see the video, but they won't hear anything. So include system audio is there for you as well. And then I'm simply going to click desktop to say that I want to share my entire desktop. And so now I can bring up anything on my computer. I can go to websites. I can launch my browser. I can launch uh, presentations, PowerPoints, whatever I want uh, to display. My audience will now see my screen. Now, when you're done sharing, you need to remember to turn this off. And so in order to turn this off, I'm going to go back down here in this little box where my uh, meeting is happening. I'm going to click there. It's going to bring my meeting back up. I now have my meeting toolbar here. Now my sharing button has the little X on it. I'm going to click there to stop sharing. Now, another thing about sharing is you can give people control of your computer while you're sharing, and it's actually shared control. So well, the way you do this is first you have to be sharing. So I'm going to share my desktop again. And now at the top of my toolbar, it says I am presenting. And up here, I can give control. So I click this drop down, and this will allow me to choose any other person in the meeting with me, and I can give them control of my computer. So that's another option for you as well.